Moving inside to the volleyball court, Bedford hosting St. Mary Catholic Central. We start the first kicking mules with a slim lead. Victoria Gray locks, loads, and fires. An absolute shot that started some mule momentum. Bedford with the chance at set point. A great dig by Olivia Brown and a set by Kaylin Schroeder, followed by another gray laser beam. Kicking Mules take set 1, 25-18. Set 2 not as close as the first. Bedford not just doing it on offense, but defense as well. Brown with the big time block and the Mules move closer to a sweep. Third set, the closest so far. Bedford with a chance to put it away once again. It's gray. Bedford takes the third set and the sweep. The Mules are on a roll. That's their ninth straight win. We had an amazing week of practice and it led up to this moment. We had a hard time beating them my freshman, sophomore, and junior year, and we came in this game pumped up, ready to go. We actually have tried like separate, like several rotations, so that one has been working, so we went with it and stuck with it, and from the get-go, we were on it. Our motto is, what's your why? And we every time we step on that court, we have a sign in our locker room, like, what's your why? Why are we here? And that will get us on the state run. Brad Waz, Nikki, and Norm McGee, what did you guys see? Well, coming in, this was a matchup we did not want to miss. Bedford 18-2, while SMCC coming in 16-1-1. One one. Multiple Division I commits on both sides. But from the very beginning, Bedford's offense was clicking. Oh, my God. Not just the serve-receive keeping them out of system, but, man, what the weapons they had. Every girl on that floor that was a hitter showed up. You've got Victoria Gray committed to Indiana. Olivia Brown, who really was the star of the show tonight with what she did on both sides of the net. She's headed to Bowling Green and the setting tonight of Kaylin Schroeder all across the board. I'll give you one in particular. She's running backwards and she puts a ball all the way across court to the one zone so that their outside hitter could hit and she did it with ease. We saw Bedford run away with the second set. SMCC played their best set there in the third. Much more of what we were expecting coming into this match. A tight set, but for SMCC, just their second loss, second time they've lost to this Bedford team. They're going to be a team that's going to be reckoned with. What was their biggest concern tonight? Um, well, overpasses. We saw that the whole game. And then when they would get a, a couple of points, service error. And that was, that was a repeat. That was every set. SMCC came in here having won 15 in a row, but their win streak comes to an end while Bedford has now won nine in a row.